Hello, my lovely Libra. Welcome to your April reading and happy full moon. Since I do record this reading in the full moon energy, happy full moon loves. Let's see loves what we have for you, how these energies are there for you. As a general reading, my highly resonate with you might be here or there a message and of course taking whatever is there for you and leaving what is not as the general readings my highly resonate with you my highly do not let's elapse libras what we have for you and how the blessings are there for you. We have the devil energy, we have the ace of cups, and we have the justice, which is your major arcana, and three of pentacles. All right, there's a lot of Libras here that want to leave a particular situation and it's kind of like once I found I'm out this could be a job situation work-wise energy career-wise because something here with the devil doesn't really go or fulfills you in the way you might want for some of you, this could be a connection you are into. I, I'm, I'm hearing love-hate energy. But let's see. The Six of Wands is here. The Emperor is here. The Lovers is here. And Ten of Cups. So what I'm seeing here, many, many of you loves, you... You definitely are willing to let go something. Could be past energy. But Six of Wands is the minor arcana of strength. Overcoming a situation, letting it go for good. And it's more likely taking your life in your own hands or putting your heart in your own sleeve. Because you definitely want a better energy, a better situation. Overall, I feel here many, many Libras this month. It's one of a kind month, but also Justice and the Emperor are the opposite ones. Libra, Aries, Libra, you know, you are all about us. And the Emperor, it's more likely about me. So for those of you who till now have been that what works for us, now it's kind of what about me? It's kind of there is um, some kind of contract here about the well-being. I choose what is right for me so I can be happy. This probably are the best cards anyone can have it the devil energy clarifier we have two of wands yeah the decision here it's made knight of pentacles but i feel here could be a decision that been very slow into making it seven of wands it's like now i learn that i don't need to resist just going with the flow in the slow energy. For some of you, you are now finally understanding that slow is fast and fast is slow. Because many, many times when we try to control things, it could get harder. And many other times when we are just letting them flow, start moving quite fast. So that's what I'm feeling here. Look at this Seven of Pentacles. Resisting here took longer for whatever you wanted. But now it's kind of like 
a different thing. For some of you, yes. Once you put yourself in the first row, you will see yourself in a whole different vibration. Because I feel here and I truly believe there is a Libra who could put others before you. Or I put everyone else ahead and I was the last. Now, not any longer. Now, not any longer. For some of you, it's kind of finally I found how certain things work. Also, the devil and the lovers are very opposite energies. There is something that you feel like is not complying with your energy any longer. There's also here a Libra who could be dealing with someone very opposite of yours. The emperor and justice are the opposites. The devil and the lovers are the opposites. So indeed here, there's something here that probably in the beginning where we are so different, but we love each other, where it's great. And over the sudden, you feel like you grow different directions and go different directions. I also see here there is a great, great success achieved by a Libra. There is a, some kind of contract that will bring you to a whole new dimension. Was the Emperor here speaking to you? Knight of Swords. Very, very quick energy. As I said, this Knight of Pentacles, it's more likely holding you back, this devil energy. And once you are putting yourself, as I said, in the first row, it's coming the Knight of Swords, the fast movement. Yes, Six of Pentacles, Hermit, Moon, Seven of Swords, and Magician. I feel also it's a quite tremendous fear of going so fast forward or like the thing starts to work for you one after another one and feels like it's something you ask the universe so the universe will deliver we have the king of swords knight of swords then king of swords it's you is the way you see yourself clear i definitely feel it's about clarity seeing them the pros and the cons in anything here is to go forward. There's also here a Libra. So pay attention, loves, because we have multiple messages for this general reading. There's also here a Libra who goes through some kind of legal situation. And this month is crucial. It seems here for some of you being straightforward or speaking when you need or how you need with whomever you need. There is um, a winning of a suit or law case here. But I definitely see here movement forward and movement fast. Don't even afraid. Whatever here it's coming. It's because you very much deserve it. There's also a lot of possibilities, a lot of opportunities open up for you. A lot of doors are opening up for you. And it's more likely the second week through the third week of this month. As you see here, we have the Seven of Swords. Seven of Pentacles, Seven of Wands. The Seven of Cups is the one missing. Seven of Cups, it's kind of like you get answers whatever you ask the universe. You get opportunities, whatever you've been prayed for. So since here, like a breakthrough month. The advice from, the advice from Spirit, we have Two of Swords, 
we have five of wands we have strength and we have judgment underneath we have nine of pentacles be confident stay confident stay in your high vibration energy and it's more likely say to yourself you are gonna make it what i'm seeing here there is a two of swords and five of wands speak up for yourself stand up for yourself know who you are i also feel that some of you you will definitely overcome a karmic energy could be a certain people in your life could be a specific person could be a situation out there spirit says be open for some of you libras especially professionally even though there is a lot of hate you know if you are in a public eye let people talk because hate or not they will lift you up okay and seeing here a uh, oracle for you this is the energy oracle cards we have add jana chant possibilities so look at this all open doors they're all open doors so let these possibilities to walk through and look at here the contract for some of you, yes, you might even sign a contract that will bring quite a lot of possibilities. Many, many actual possibilities are coming in forward. But I will read really quick this adjuntant possibilities. Many unconsidered options. For some of you, you got to consider some kind of options out there. Sometimes the force of habit keeps you stuck and aware of potentially healthier and happier choices at hand. Yet, every moment gives you the option to open a different door and take a different course. Whatever it's in your thoughts, behavior, or major life decisions. Unlike other cards in this deck, which you might have some confusion or vacillation about which course to take this card is here to tell you that you have many options it's time to take a wider look at things as you consider the many life choices available you will feel more and more empowered and motivated to make the decisions that brings happiness strength and forward motion in terms of your goals this card could indicate unknown and previously unconsidered ideas perhaps there is a marketing tool you haven't thought of a connection that you haven't taped or even an entirely different direction that would be more suited for you be conscious, be aware, and be flexible and willing to take new and different actions now. And for you, loves, the affirmation for this month, I am open and willing to take my life in new directions. I am becoming more aware of my many options for harmony and optimism in many thoughts and in all my choices each day so indeed here for the libras i'm speaking there's some kind of great options opportunities that are there and you can benefit beautifully all what you need to do is to put yourself number one top priority you know, we have top secrets, top priority. So you are the number one. You are on the pedestal. So you can make the best out there from the best. So Libras, thank you so much for coming through. Take care of you and you have a great month. Till the next time.
Namaste.